Once we've done our shaping, we're gonna go into our set and let's pull out our double-ended pushy. We're gonna start with the larger end. You can see that it's been contoured to follow the shape of the natural nail. It's super thin so that it's effective in pushing back the cuticle to even up your shape. Even though it's ultra thin, it's also been buffed along the edges so that it's super safe along the surface of the nail. You don't have to worry about the nail getting scratched from the tool itself. I'm going to use this exactly as I would with the manicure in soft, small, circular motions. This helps me create that roundness and that shape evenly on each toe. Next, we're gonna use the hooked in of the pushy to get up along the edges of the nail. This is what you can use to get underneath that edge and make sure that those corners aren't growing into the skin and to make sure that you did a good job in removing those. And then I'm gonna go along the edge of the nail and just make sure that I remove any debris that might be up in the nail from our socks or whatever. Once we've pushed back the cuticle and cleaned out from underneath the nails, we're going to use our rock hard cuticle nipper to go in and remove any little bits and pieces. If it's in the corner, especially on the big toes, we find that uh, we'll have a little bit of excess cuticle back into the corners of the nails, and that's where the sharp pointed tip really comes in handy. It allows you to get in deep and remove that excess skin. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Now, I only use the tip of the nipper when I just have one little piece, and it's usually if it's in the corners of the cuticle area or down in the side walls. Anything that needs to be removed out or on top of the cuticle, simply lay the blade flat along the skin. That way the curve of the natural toe works as a, like an apex. It puts that piece of skin at the highest point, and then your blade traps that in the center and removes it. Lastly, I'm going to use the 400 side or the buffer side of the buffer shiner to help smooth out and tighten the cuticles and just remove the shine off the surface of the natural nail so that my polish has better adhesion. Notice that when I buff the surface of the nail, I follow the shape of the cuticle and also the contour of the natural nail so that I'm never filing straight across or I'm never buffing straight across just to make sure that the nails finishes the same all the way across.